Welcome to the Original Gangsters Podcast. I'm your host, Scott Bernstein. Going to take you back up to the Great White North for another quick hitter edition. Things moving fast and furious up there. Quebec City, Hell's Angels bust this week. Familiar figure to OG audiences, Mario Bananas. Uh, and I want to just tell everyone out in French Canadian world, I am trying my best to get these names right. I apologize. Uh, Mario Augier, Mario Bananas, uh, the former sergeant at arms of the Quebec City Hells Angel, uh, has been in the middle of this war between the Quebec City Hells Angels and the Blood Family Mafia. Uh, Mario Bananas just recently, uh, as earlier this month, met with police in Quebec City and declared that the war on Canadian soil between the Hells Angels and the Blood Family Mafia was over with. The violence was going to cease after a year uh, of uh, murder, blood, shootings, bombings. Now he's under arrest along with another pretty uh, high-ranking figure in the Quebec City Hells Angels, uh, Marco Polo, they call him, Mark Roberge. Um, former rock machine guy back in the uh, Quebec biker war that patched over to the Hell's Angels. And his right-hand man, a younger uh, biker protege of his, Christian Boucher, uh, who goes by the nickname Cree Cree, he was indicted as well. So that's uh, three Hell's Angels at least, and then another dozen or so people, I'm not positive, what their affiliations are, but they're being accused of selling cocaine, uh, GHB, meth, uh, over a three-year investigation. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's been a, been a busy boy since he got out of prison in 2019, according to this um, recent arrest uh, indictment coming out of the Crown, the SQ in Quebec City. Uh, Mario Bananas was, as of last month, we're told here at uh, the OG, was in Europe hunting Blood Family Mafia leader Ice Pick Termel, who has a half a million dollar murder contract on his head right now for what he did to Mario Bananas' cousins. Uh, at some point last month, the Blood Family Mafia tried to kidnap Mario Bananas. They were unsuccessful, but within a couple of days, they kidnapped a couple of his cousins. They tortured them, cut off uh, appendages. One of the cousins freed himself and his uh, other hostage by killing one of the Blood Family Mafia members that was standing guard. Um, very dramatic. Most of the Blood Family Mafia is behind bars right now. David Tremel is on the run in Europe. We're told that he's backed by the Rizzuto mob, got backing from them when he went to war with the Quebec City Hells Angels. Last year, over a 10% tax that the Quebec City Angels had always put on uh, street gang drug activity. Um, Termel is a dead man walking. I mean, this, this is that's what our take is here at, at OG Pod. Uh, but the violence in Quebec City is over with. But it doesn't look like anything's close to being over with uh, with Mario Bananas. He's going to have to go back uh, and face the crown. He did 10 years in prison from 2009 to 2019 for his role in the Quebec biker war. We'll see what happens, but I don't think this is going to have really uh, any after math or, or, or ripple effects when it comes to the blood family mafia stuff. That is pretty much the the chapter has been written. The only thing we're waiting for is if Termel is caught by Interpol and uh, extradited back to Canada for charges, or if he's caught first by the Hells Angels and, and left dead in the street somewhere in Europe. Um, so we'll, we'll keep you updated. Oh, a lot of things happening in, in real time and real fast, but the Quebec City Hells Angels chapter was founded back in the fall of 1988, and it's uh, got in a reputation over the years for being a very close-knit group, well-oiled machine, almost 
more like a mafia family than a biker club. A lot of the same names have been there in leadership roles dating all the way back to the 80s, uh, the Pelletier group, uh, Pelletier family, as well as a couple other, uh, Hart and Hutton. Uh, I know I'm, I'm, Judas was one of the, the main guys there too. Uh, and shout out, shout out to Quebec City Hells Angels. Uh, but just wanted to end and, and let you know what's going on up there. Mario Bananas, Marco Polo, Cree Cree, and 12 others under indictment right now behind bars in a major cocaine, meth, and GHB case out of Quebec City. OG Pod Scott Bernstein out. Mm-hmm.